today guys this is awesome texas coasters and in today's video we will be discussing the theme parks that are on my bucket list to go to this year so theme park number one that i want to go to i've been there before but i would love to go to cedar point now you may have noticed this is my new coaster wall so cedar point's right there i also have a bigger map right up there so that is my number one theme park to go to the summer of 2017 I mean, what can you not like about Cedar Point? I mean, they got everything. I've been, I've been on their newest coaster either. I've already been. So, and I want to see the new Arm C Mean Streak progress. So, I hope to go to Cedar Point. So that's my number one bucket list. My number two coming in a spot is Holiday World. I've been wanting to go to Holiday World. It is so close. So we live in Cincinnati, Mason area, and it is so close. Holiday World is so close. To our house like it's really close so i've been wanting to go there ride the voyage thunderbird to see the park and the water park it's got a great water park so i also have the map up here right here it's probably harder to see but i don't know um kind of smaller map but i like to frame my maps so that's my number two spot and these uh, co uh theme park plans or coaster bucket list things that i want to go to they're not 100 percent going to happen but Cedar Point most likely to happen, and the other ones are not for sure yet, but they're on my bucket list, like I said. And these are in any particular order. Well, Cedar Point would be my number one, obviously, but then after that, I would like to go to any of these parks. So, number three spot would be Kentucky Kingdom. I do not have a map for it, but I heard a lot of great things about Kentucky Kingdom. It used to be the old Six Flags Park, I think. And, yeah, and then they have Storm Chaser there. And all kinds of rides. So that is my number two spot would be Kentucky Kingdom. And number four spot, we might go to Florida this year, but if we do go to Florida, we have to stop at Carowinds in South Carolina, depending on how we go. I think we should go down to Carowinds on the way down, stop at Carowinds because they got some great rides. Fury 325, one of the best coasters. So yeah, Carowinds is definitely on the list um, as my top 10. I like amusement parks probably even of all time to for my bucket list to go to just because it has Fury and a bunch of other rides and Terminator. Well, anyway, it comes in the number four spot. Um, number five would be Dollywood. Well, I'd probably switch those two: Dollywood, go to Dollywood, and then Carowinds because Dollywood they have the Lightning Rod. The only bad thing about Lightning Rod, I got this little booklet right here. I thought it was pretty cool. I went to Gatlinburg, but I didn't get to go to um, uh, Pigeon Forge. I, we went past Dollywood, actually. I got to see it, see Dollywood. I just didn't get to go because we had to go back because I had school the next week. So we only went pretty short, and we had a, something else to do up there. But that was a good time in Pigeon Forge area, seeing that, seeing Dollywood. I could see some rides from the uh, highway interstate thing, but it's definitely on my bucket list to go to. Even though Lightning Rod's not working very well. I still want to go there. I've heard it. It's a really cool park. Kind of like Silver Dollar City. So that is on. That would be like on the way to Carowinds. Or on the way back from Carowinds. Go there. I prefer on the way there. To build up to the 305. Or 325. Fury 325. Did I just say 305? Oh yeah, that's Intimidator. My bad. So anyway, that would be my number fourth. Or fifth. Fourth or fifth, Carowinds or Dollywood, you can switch back. Fourth or fifth. So yeah, so yeah. If you guys have any questions about anything, any things about my coaster wall, um, yeah. So it's basically like that's Kings Island section over there. Kings Island the map. Got Mr. Timbers ID thing. It's probably really hard to see, and because everything's so small, maybe I'll do a closer up video in the future. But Cedar Point and then Holiday World. So yeah. I need to visit these parks and get some good footage and make some cool intros for Austin, Texas Coasters. Yeah, so anyway. Oh, and I might be coming up for the next theme park bucket list. Like, theme park, top, like, 20 theme parks I want to visit in the United States. And especially, I want to go to the theme parks in Texas, Texas, because I am from Austin, Texas Coasters. But... Anyway, that's on my bucket list, and you got to live in the now, 
and ride on. Keep calm and ride on. That's my saying. No, it's not. But anyway, you guys have a great day. Make sure you hit a thumbs up on this video. Hit that subscribe button down there. You guys have a great day. Austin, Texas Coasters, bringing you the coaster views of 2017 and beyond to the future. You guys have a great day. Hey, what is up, guys? This is Austin from Austin, Texas Coasters. Make sure you, if you're not a subscriber, hit the subscribe button. Put a thumbs up on the video, comment below, and you guys have a great day.